before we came on the air, Kentucky escaped Vermont. And Mark Pope knows a little something about Kentucky. He played for the Wildcats, after all. Today, Mark Pope is the head basketball coach at Utah Valley. If anyone in the country has a tougher start to the season than them, I'd sure love to see it. And they made sure you saw it as we go all access with the Wolverines on a tough two-step, a really tough two-step, out of the proverbial game. We're marketing it as the toughest 24 hours in the history of college basketball. Hey, I call it strong two right now, but Connor's denied. Strong two, but Connor's denied. Good job, good job, good job, good job. I, I dig it. Um, I want my guys to know they've done the hardest thing in the history of college basketball. The Wolverines of Utah Valley open the 17-18 college basketball season on the road against the Kentucky Wildcats. It doesn't get any better than this. This is the biggest lineup they can possibly put on the floor. It means they're a little nervous. I'm telling you what it means. It means they're over there a little freaking nervous. We have reached halftime, and UVU leading Kentucky 34 to 25. Who would have thunk this? Together. Yes. Rebound and transition! Hey, hey, hey. Kentucky is going to survive Utah Valley. UVU will learn what they need to learn because they're not going to play anybody tougher this whole season other than these first two teams. The trick for us guys, whatever emotion you have right now, let's check them in the door, okay? Let's go do this thing in Duke, all right? One, two, three. Family. Down here in Lexington, it was, a, it was a tough game. We battled. I'm proud of our guys. Now it's on to Cameron Indoor and got Duke tomorrow, so we're going to bounce back. We got into Durham late last night. About to go watch some film, had to shoot around at Cameron Indoor. You're going to find Allen and Trent in transition because they want catch and shoot threes in transition. There's no history of Utah Valley. There is not. You're living it. You are the history right now. And that is an amazing opportunity. Some people will be scared by that. Just pulled up to Cameron Indoor. About time to finish off this toughest 24 the right way. Let's go. We didn't come here to hide. We didn't come here to just sneak through. We came here to play the very best in the country and drill them. Every single one of you guys, your whole freaking life waiting for this. Grayson Allen, the finish. Trent with a three from the wing. Mark Pope calls timeout. As Duke explodes in the second half. As the fans raise the letter K to signify win number 1,000 as a Blue Devil. Congratulations, coach. Congratulations. Good luck. Hey, listen to me, all right? Um, that team is really good. They're really freaking good. And when we talk about this being the toughest 24 hours in the history of college basketball, it's really true. We got to come play two of the best teams in America. We also are very clear on what we need to work on. This toughest 24, was everything that we hoped it would be. Man, holding their own indeed. 23 minutes, 19 seconds, they led. They'll always be able to say they led against Kentucky. They led at the half, by the way, at Rupp Arena, and then 746 against Duke before the Blue Devils just simply pulled away.